Real estate is one of the worst environmental offenders when it comes to carbon emissions, even worse than cars. Older buildings fueled with oil-fueled boiler systems top the list of offenders. So what's the solution? Diana Olick joins us with her continuing series on climate startups. Hi, Diana. Hey, Kelly. And, you know, I grew up in a pre-war building, so I know what we're talking about here, those systems. Most of the time, the heat is just way too hot in one room, cold in another. So the race is now on to electrify these buildings. But that'll take a lot of time and money. So one startup is trying to reduce emissions from what's already there. The answer to old-fashioned, dirty, oil-based heating is electricity and heat pumps. Companies like Block Power, Gradient, and Runwise are working on that transformation. But a Brooklyn, New York startup called Kelvin is working to improve and decarbonize the existing old systems. They invented the COSY. The COSY uh, is used to get control over those old radiator systems. We're able to stop heat from being released unnecessarily into those hot rooms and get it more efficiently to the cold rooms, um, which increases the efficiency of the building and makes everybody more, more comfortable. The COSY is basically smart insulation around the radiator that improves steam distribution around the building. It can push the heat more efficiently to cold rooms and also store heat in the enclosure when the boiler's off so you can use it later. As a result, the boiler doesn't operate as much, burning less fuel, saving money and lowering carbon emissions. The Cozies are controlled by the user with a simple interface that lets them set the temperature, including scheduling, etc. And all those systems are connected to the cloud, to our databases, which help determine what the building is doing in response to the individual need of each room. Kelvin says it has 10,000 cozies installed today and expects to triple that by next year. Fast growth that is attractive to investors like 2150. This happened to be the most elegant solution we came across for those very hard to decarbonize old buildings, uh, and yet a viable business that can scale with venture type returns. In addition to project financing, Kelvin is backed by 2150, Third Sphere, and Avesta Fund. Total funding so far, $36 million. And the government's IRA funding has been huge for Kelvin. A tax credit is helping them offer lower-income buildings a subscription model at no cost. That's something they wouldn't be able to afford otherwise. They're also a big part of New York's Local Law 97, one of the prescriptive items in the law, actually, which requires owners of large buildings to reduce carbon emissions starting next year with the goal of a 40 percent reduction by 2030. So a lot of homeowners are familiar with if you, you have to do the, the scan for the, the old oil tank to see if you still have one of those around. Now, it seems like those are becoming pretty much obsolete. So for the apartment buildings, this is really kind of the next battleground, it seems like. Yeah, and we've seen a lot of companies that we've actually profiled here. One was called Block Power, which was electrifying buildings. But again, it's a huge task in a place like New York City where pre-war buildings are the norm. And so to get that oil transferred to electric is going to be a tough one. So this way, at least you're reducing emissions while you still have the oil there. And what's the financial impact of all of this so, to, the, to the typical renter? Yeah, I don't have to tell you guys how much oil prices are going up. And so yeah. that, you know, plays into your utilities. But Kelvin says they can reduce the costs by 25 to 40 percent hmm. of oil just by having to heat less. Interesting. All right. Thanks, Diana. Good to, good to have you in the house. Great to be here. Will we see you Wednesday in Washington? Are you going Tuesday to be and Wednesday at Climate Week, New York City. I will oh, be here. Oh, you'll be That's here. We'll here. miss you. Climate we'll be there. Week. Why else would I all be right. here? All right. <laughs> Good. Good to be with you.